they're miracle oils. I think it's something every house should have in the medicine cabinet. It works, it works. First aid in a bottle, the makers claim. It relieves pain, they say. It's natural, it's safe, with no known side effects. And it's made right here in Australia. I was a pathology paramedic and I got interested in aromatherapy by uh, doing a course and to me it just made absolute sense. I couldn't believe that we weren't using aromatherapy and essential oils um, in hospital. Cheryl Watt is the creator. There are loads of others on the market. Why is this one better than the rest? My product's very different in that it is a very, very strong blend and it, there are 11 essential oils. Listed with the Therapeutic Goods Association as a medicine, Cheryl says it can be used for a variety of conditions. It's something that you can use for cuts and scratches, minor burns, um, any swelling, for headaches, for arthritis, for pain. Does it work? The research that I've done with the essential oils has actually shown that they actually do work. And the thermal imaging has been a visual aid for people. Just relax, Susan, we'll just take the image now. Nurse and thermographer Pauline Rose did clinical trials on the product. Digital infrared um, thermal imaging is well known for visualising pain. It's the only method you've got for that. So you can see there's a, there's a major area of inflammation here. And in the core of that, you've got what we call white hot. Well, I was very surprised at how quick, quickly it worked. And um, I was also surprised because uh, we had a wide range of people with different problems and the, the types of things I was hearing them say about, you know, how much better they felt. And that's you, yeah. about five minutes later. So that's a going. really big change. Yeah. You feel better? Change, yeah. yeah. Each and every day, I'm amazed. I have thousands of testimonials now from people that continue to let me know just what they've used them for. These are shocking pictures. Yes, uh, they're quite traumatic actually. I was trapped in the car for over an hour. It was just horrific. Esther Steele horrific. considers herself lucky to have survived this car accident. Cut from the wreckage, she was flown to hospital. What injuries did you end up with? Um, I ended up with uh, a broken pelvis in two places. Uh, I had nerve damage to my face and I also had um, severe bruising all over my, especially my arm and also my leg. She was taking 22 pills a day to help manage the pain. She started using Be Relieved and says she was able to cut back to just two. Within three weeks I was able to hobble around quite well so I, I give credit to, to the oils. They're very powerful. They're miracle oils. Yeah. yeah. Ida Glavich mm -hmm. is another Be Relieved believer. She calls it the magic oil. It works. It works. So, could be mind over matter, but I don't think so. Ida <laughs> used it on her next door neighbour, yeah. Mary Ann Mahmoud. The five year old had had tummy pains for three days. She'd been to hospital, to the doctors, and to have an ultrasound. But Ida says it wasn't until she rubbed the oil on Mary Ann. The pain disappeared. When she slept all night that night, after three nights not sleeping, it was heaven for mum as well as her. I think rather than essential oils, a lot of them are just snake oils. Dr Rick Gordon warns being listed with the Therapeutic Goods Association just means the product is low risk. There's no guarantee it actually works. But I can rub tiger balm into my hand and I can change the circulation in my hand so that on thermal imaging it will change. So what? Ida, Mary Ann and Esther still swear feel. by it. After all, they say, if it made them feel better, where's the harm in that? <laughs>